Hello guys and welcome to my channel One Black Operation 1 and welcome back to the next episode of CMS uh, Car Mechanic Simulator. If you don't know what CMS means, it means Car Mechanic Simulator and this is 2021. So yeah, on the last episode, uh, what do I do on the last episode? Oh yeah, we got the car ready for, I don't know what I'm doing now, hang on a minute, I'm trying to... Okay, so yeah, we got the car, the Supra up and ready to sort the electronics out and I hope hopefully hope <laughs> I already can't speak that look at that and I'm hoping that this episode we can finish the Supra and we can get a head start on that Mustang by stripping it down and getting everything repaired okay so if you haven't actually checked out my car mechanic simulator playlist there is a link at the top go and check that out there's some great content on there might learn a thing or two no I didn't want to do that Probably learn a little bit better than what I'm doing at the moment. I'm playing like a proper noob. Um, so yeah, go and check that out if you haven't already. Uh, definitely check out the last episode. Because uh, where we got the super ready to rock and roll. And she does look a beaut, guys, doesn't she? She is a beauty. I cannot wait to... Uh, unfortunately, we are flogging it, like I said. But I uh, can't wait to finish it. Get some nice screenshots of that. Um, so yeah, so I'm just working on a client's car here, the story car. I've got one more part here to discover, which I'm thinking is either air filter or is it going to be radiator? It might be radiator. No, radiator looks fine. Uh, so yeah, it's either air filter or it's going to be a bushing or bearing. Then again, it could be a fuse. No, I don't think it's a filter. Filter's brand new. I did the filter. So as you can see, I have been grinding out money here because we, yeah, we struggled a bit last on the last episode for money. I think I've checked all this already, and I yeah. So I've been grinding out some missions, earning some boxes, some crates, so we can get some uh, some uh, scrap in that, <coughs> and also been grinding out money so we can actually finish that super off. So yeah, we're going to be looking into. We got to, like I said, do the electronics on the Supra. And uh, I'm hoping to do a little testing. But then I don't know whether I'm going to do the testing on the Supra or the Mustang. I might do it on the Mustang because I might end up just keeping the Mustang. So I might do some more projects in between, which I'm going to be doing some separate videos on. I'm going to have to put this thing through the test, I think, because I think it's a bushing. I'm hoping, actually, I'm hoping it's not because it's, it's engine problems on this vehicle. I'm hoping that it is not a crankshaft bearing, because it could be a crankshaft bearing. The only way to kind of eliminate other things is by putting on the test path. And if it's nothing to do with bearings, bushing, suspension, then it's got to be a crankshaft bearing. It's the only thing I can put it down to. It's kind of the only thing... No, look at that. There's definitely something wrong with the right rear suspension. And I'm thinking wheel bearing. Yeah, wheel bearing will break. Stuffing. Alright, okay. Well. Shit. So. It's probably more likely to be a crankshaft bearing then. So we'll have a look at the crankshaft bearing. And I just got another achievement. I'm flying through these achievements, man. Look at that. Got great habit. Up you go. Thank you very much. Right, let's get the oil pan. So yeah, so. I do have a lot planned, like I said, whether I'm going to be testing the performance parts out on the Mustang or the Supra, I don't really know yet, it depends how I feel. Um, oh, it's an oil filter. <laughs> it's an oil filter. Look at that, symbols. Symbols. Put that bad boy on there. And we are done. Alright, i got to put some more. i got to do the rest of the tasks. But we're done with repairs at the moment. We've got to do body repairs, but that's about... I suppose they are classified as repairs, aren't they? Let's do oil. So I'm going to do all the fluids quickly, and then we're going to get into the body. Okay, so we've hit. I've hit another little snag here, um, which means we are kind of far behind, which I don't like being. So I might have to stop work on this, get this prepared, and stop working on it because we do have to tune the car. We have to get a tuning by 10 to 15. Now we could obviously guess that with numbers from the tuning parts, the performance parts, but um, it's also best to get on the dyno, do a 
do a, like a base run and then add the performance parts to go from there. So, yeah, I don't know. We could do it that way, I suppose. Front right door, front run fender and hood. Okay, let's do them quickly. Shouldn't gonna take long. But then we can always buy, because the dyno is going to cost us how much for the dyno? 20, 20 grand for the dyno. So we are going to need dyno, obviously, to do like, you know, for more. Because if we're going to get performance missions in now, we are going to need that dyno. Nice. So that should be all tasks. But the perform wheel alignment, which we can do now, which you guys actually haven't seen. This is another good feature with this game. New features they've added in. They've added wheel alignment and they've added headlight or headlamp alignment. Sorry. So wheel alignment is easy. You just got to make sure it says zero by tapping the right buttons. And not going too far. Like that. And then you're done. There's a wheel alignment. And then obviously headlamp alignment is exactly... The the same kind of concept, um, but you have obviously your headlamps. You've got to keep them in this bottom square. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I like I like those little the, the, the little things like that. Just add immersive, you know, just add the immersive feel to this game. But anyway, let's jump on to the super. Let's get this super done quickly because it ain't going to take long. I think I might hold off the performance parts for the time being. Oh, what's my hood up? Good night. So I might just hold off for the performance parts for the time being because we need the money to get this mission done. The story mission but uh, yeah so we're on to electrics now we need abs pump we need to sort out the fuse box do i actually have fuses on me i might even i might have some fuses no i don't have fuses okay so let's mark all these fuses to buy i think i've just done fuse box yeah jump on the electronics store and we want what do you want right we want abs pump and we want I th I'm not going to bother buying the actual um, ABS module, just in case I've already got one. I don't know what i got and what I haven't got, really. And then we should be able to fire this baby up once this is all in. ABS pump. Do I have module? No, I don't. Okay, so I do need to buy a module. Uh, let's just go back. No. Get, click that. Thank you. Module. ABS module. And then what else is actually missing from the car? Can I please... Oh, I hate the camera angles still in this game. Not a fan of the camera angles in this game still. I wish... Would, would have thought they would learn from the beginning. Um, probably that. So we need radiator. Do I have a radiator? No. I don't need a fan. I just literally need a radiator. For this thing. And we need a intercooler as well. What intercooler do we need? Large intercooler. We'll buy that one. So that's electronics done, and now we're doing the cooling. And then, actually, I think we're done. She looks beautiful, though, doesn't she? You must admit, that blue on the engine, you got to admit, guys, it just looks freaking fantastic. Yes? No? You agree with me. Yeah, you agree with me. She purrs and hisses like a kitty. Alright. Here we go, guys. 120,000. We bought it for 17 grand from Junkyard, wasn't it? Was it from the Junkyard we bought her? And look at her now. It's going to be sad to see her go. I'm going to shed a tear. But, unfortunately, she's got to go. Actually, no. <laughs> gotcha. Screenshot. All right. Okay. No. I am going to do the performance parts. All right. I'm only going to do little bits. I'm not going to do a full engine rebuild with full performance parts. I'm only going to do itty bitty little bits. All right. So air filter is going to be one of them. Then we got ignition coils and spark plugs. That's going to be secondary. Take that off. Ignition coils. Fuel filter. And then I will probably do a full exhaust system. If I can do a full exhaust system, I don't know if I can do it from. It might have to. Oh, I don't know. It might have to be from Manny back. 
But if I can do a full exhaust system from from literally block back and do the manifold and that as well, that would be pretty sweet, wouldn't it? That would be pretty sweet. <coughs> I'm hoping I have enough bloody parts for this as well. Alright, so what do we want? Uh, air filter type A. Please say I've got an air filter type A in here. Yep, air filter type A. Uh, let's do plugs and right, this fuel filter, I'm going to get a fuel pump as well. Right, there's ignition coils. I'm going to buy six in it. Is it six? Yeah, I think it's six. If not, then we got a spare. Yeah, because it is a straight six, so. Let's get the sparkies in. Uh, sparkies, thank you. Coils going in now. So I took a screenshot of the actual price, like parts prices, etc., etc. So then I can go back, look at that, and go right. Okay, so we've gained or we've lost. I'm hoping gain because you are kind of putting more money into the car. So I'm hoping it is going to be a gain. Even if it's a game like, well, we know it's 120 grand, yeah, so we can go for our final price on the game, but I want to know individually, like, how much you lose for the parts taken off and how much you gain for the performance parts put on, because there's two categories. You've got normal, you know, you've got normal parts, and then you've got the performance parts. Um, throttle. Can I do a throttle? Throttle, throttle. Where is the throttle? And I want manifold as well, don't I? Can we do Manny? Please do Manny. Uh, B U T B U T B U two T. Thank you. Get it right. That's the one. The one. The one. That's the one. And the one. Yes, it is. That's the one. And the one. Okay. I oh, know. I lost it. I lost it years ago. So we have a middle muffler, but I'll do the exhaust in a mojo. I'm looking for actual throttle bodies. Thank you. Thank you. Coming in strong. Uh, take this part off. See, I can, I know I can spend, yeah, you know, I can spunk the four grand on this thing, no problem, because I'm making a minimum 120k. If we don't gain no money, no extra, like funds, doing modified or putting performance parts on, then it's not hard to go back, is it? Fuel rail. Yeah, we're doing that as well whilst we're here. Fuel rail. Either either, it's just going to look sexy with that red in it. Yeah, it is going to look sexy with that red. Oh, I need to do manifold. What am I doing? I need to take all this back off again. Oh, rip. Mop, 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 mop. More work and more XP. Manifold. Was it, was it intake manifold? Or was it exhaust manifold a bolt? Oh no, I can't remember. No, it was... No. Um, did they have an intake manifold? Intake manifold. Uh, no, no. Uh, no, I just wasted time. Oh, guys, I just wasted my time. Actually, think. Right, thinking about it, since I have the manifold off, you can't get a manifold on in performance parts. Uh, double check, but no, you got. You can obviously buy manifolds, but I mean, you can't buy the manifolds for the for this uh, six cylinder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend the scrap I got and I'm actually going to um, improve the quality of the manifold to three star. That just adds that little bit extra funds to it. So we might as well do something whilst we got it off, haven't we? And then we'll put it back on. Three stars, baby. Ah, oh, brings back memory of GTA, getting three stars, you know, in a car like this. Ah, sweet, sweet times. Right, uh, oh, I um, put the fuel rail back on, have I? 
Put the Aura back on. Right, so we need to get rid of the Turbo. Turbo off, and then the Exhaust Manifold, because we definitely did buy the Exhaust Manifold. Um, come on, Pinky. Why is my mouse being a nipple? Okay. Do your toad. I control you, not the other way around. That's that on. I don't think t you can buy turbos, but I don't think they have the. Oh, they do! They do have the turbo. <gasps> I'm in heaven. Oh my god, that's so sexy. I wonder if you can customize performance parts, guys. <sighs> I'm getting way ahead of myself here. I know. <laughs> getting way ahead of myself. Right, okay, so I think that's all we can really do for that. We've got to obviously get it on the on the posts. We've got to do full exhaust. Well, hopefully full exhaust. I've got to be able to do... Hmm, can I do front exhaust section? If I can do front exhaust section, that's cool. Because that means I've got a full stainless steel, basically stainless steel exhaust system for a Manny back. So that would be absolutely freaking awesome. Uh, cat. No, oh, what are you doing? I know. Look at my sexy springs, but not where I wanted to be. I want the middle muffler. And of course, you, we can do the gearbox as well. I'm not going to do the gearbox though. Um, what is it? V8. It is V8, isn't it? So normal V8. Normal V8. There, thank you. Then middle muffler. Let's go actually to the exhaust section. It's so much easier, isn't it? That one and that one, and then I need. Uh, what well, I know what I'm looking for. The I6 BUT. But I don't see one. No. No. Is the game let me down? Ah, oh, no, guys. Rip. Game's let me down. Game has let me down. Why dev team do this to me? You've ruined this. Ruined. You hear me, dev team? Ruined. <sighs> oh well. Let's just get these on. We ain't gonna be able to do a full exhaust system. No, I can upgrade the exhaust. Let's go and let's go and add some quality to it. I'm in heaven. Ah, oh. oh, wrong one. No, I'm in heaven. And I want that one. Thank you. Come, oh, thank you. Right. So we're going there. And yeah. Uh, we got to do fuel pump. Actually, got to do fuel pump. And maybe did buy one. I've got to put the, the sucker in. And there you go, guys. So we have a semi-full exhaust system. We've got fuel rail, fuel pump, fuel filter. All, you know, performed up, you know, modified. Turbo, intake, throttle, ignition coils and all that are done. Air filter, yeah, right. Okay, so let's get this one back outside and do one more little thing. We've got to see what it sounds like. In other words, we've got to see what it sounds like, right? See if it sounds any different. It does have a slight... A slight new tone to that. That still seems the same. But the idle, listen, it sounds a bit... Ooh, it's got a bit more of a power, isn't it? Oh. Maybe it's got a... Yeah, I don't know. It's got some soft undertones now. I think it's got a slight different, you know, high rev tone there as well. All right, okay, so I've just brought up the screenshot that I took. So parts value has gone down by six, no, 5,000, sorry. 5,166. Okay, because we were originally at 61,200. I will, if I remember, I'll put both snippets here so you guys can see. But 
I'm just going to read that anyway, yeah, if I don't. So, yeah, parts value was originally 61,200. Now we're at 56,044. Body value hasn't changed, obviously, because we haven't changed any modifications to the body, which we could do. We actually could do that. Uh, performance parts, obviously, zero originally, 10,590 now. Condition bonus, 29,351. Now, when originally it was 27,721. So we even get a condition bonus by adding performance parts on. So if you did a full engine rebuild with performance parts, you're probably going to get even more tasty money out of that. Yeah. And then so profit 109,986 and originally 102,922. So we've gained, yeah, we've gained 7,054 or something like that. 34 I don't know some of that but yeah so we've gained seven grand by adding performance parts so performance parts guys not only does it you know increase the performance of the car it actually increases your profit range so now I kind of I don't think we've been in the Mustang today by the way I don't think we start in the Mustang unfortunately I do apologize I did plan starting today but uh, I'm kind of into this you know Modifying this car, I'm kind of into trying to squeeze as much money out as possible. So we have 320 left. I could sell, obviously, a lot of this, um, which I actually might just do. So let's go sell the crap for starters. Okay, let's not. Uh, I got more crap in here. So let's just go up to there, sell all that. Yeah, thank you. Uh, we got some crates. So let's open the crates here and get some credit. And then what I'm going to do is actually going to put, I'm going to put some body modifications onto this as well. I like, I love it the way it is. I've got screenshots, and you know, you guys have got the video of this car, how it was before it gets ruined with the body modifications. No, it's not going to get ruined, guys. It won't get ruined. The only thing that's going to get ruined is my bank bands. Oh yeah, boy. Right. Okay. So let's come here. Let's get rid of that body tune in Supra. Uh, oh, ooh. this is expensive. All right, let's buy the bumpers. And let's buy the hood. The trunk, sorry. We have 800 left. That's cool. So, no, not hood. Trunk. And the bumpers. So we were at 127. Let's see if this actually makes a difference. Actually, screenshot? No, don't screenshot. I ain't gonna screenshot. You can pause it, guys. You can check back. That one on, and that one. And then front license plate. Now we're gonna move it to the spray booth. Get in the paint shop. And the factory color. I don't have enough money. Oh no, it's freaking grand, isn't it? So, so, so. And now we can spray. It's factory color. Spray. Right. Oh, yeah, that has definitely increased our profit. So just adding those parts. Okay, so that's three parts. We've gained another, what, three grand profit. It's now at 130k. So I'm going to screenshot this one. And I think it's time to actually probably get some money. Because we're kind of brasso now, aren't we? Brassic. That's the word, brassic. So now we should be able to completely renovate the body of this car. Um, just, okay, just don't go through the door that's open already, but yeah, no. Well, that one, and then we got tail lights and headlights. Which means we will need to do, I've got to go and do alignments and stuff and that before we sell. But that ain't going to take us five minutes to do, is it? That one, that one, and that one. There we go. Tasty. And we got enough money to spray this. Oh, that's the wrong bloody thing, isn't it? No, not move car. What am I doing? I really don't know what I'm doing here. Okay. Uh, B. 
B. That was B, wasn't it? Yeah, B, B. B, B? Yeah, B, B. And we have B and uh, B. Okay. Let's get this thing sprayed to factory colours again. Oh, it just freaking sexual. I just wish they added lower rims so you can lower the car. Obviously, we could put bigger rims on there. That could be a way of, like, you know, giving that illusion that it's lowered. We could do that. But that's going to cost us even more money. Money I don't want. So let's have a look at what the final price is. So 135655 I think that's about as far as we can actually bleed out of this car. Unless we do some more performance parts. You know, I could change like the alternator, water pump, power steering pump, etc, etc. We could do, you know, camshafts, headers, uh, pistons. We could do all of that. I cannot be bothered to actually do that. So we're going to keep it like that. But I need to move it to alignment. So we've got to align the wheels up because we've obviously had the wheels on and off. Headlights got to be done. Yeah, see that? Can't send out like that. Jeez, man. Oh, my God. They'd be all over the place, wouldn't they? It'd be coming back to us. Well, I suppose there's one way to get it back to us. See uh, see how well she's done. All right. Headlight. Easier to use my keyboard to do this. That's the left one. And right one's just higher. All right. So that's all the alignment's done. And she's, she is finished now. That is it. That is it. We have completely finished with the Supra. Final price. Parts value of 56,000. Body value of 37. Performance parts 10,000. Condition of 31,000. Buy price of 17,000. Profit of 118,000. And sell value of 135. So that we've made 111 from buy price. Yeah, in profit. We made 111,000 profit from buy price. But 118,000 profit in total. So there she goes, guys. She is completely, completely done. Let's sell her. Bye-bye, baby. And I just knocked over my, my vapor. Nice, cool. Well, there you go, guys. So now, no more Supra. On to the next project, which is this beauty over here. And unfortunately, like I said, we ain't going to be able to do it this episode. Uh, this episode, I've, re you know... Uh, gone over with my recordings which is always the way i always seem to do that so i'm gonna have to do a bit of editing but still unfortunately that is going to be the end but we do start this beauty in the next episode and i cannot wait so what i might do in the meantime though is i might see if i can go and find some more cars for us to work on sort of surprise cars for you guys and i'll see if i can actually find a better engine for this thing because this engine is shot to shit and it's what, a V8, 2 carb, OHV, I might go for a supercharge, or a mag. Mm. But anyway, so we might do our first engine swap for this car. Alright, but yeah, anyway guys, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, smash that thumbs up button, if you're new, subscribe and show your support. And remember, in the description, there's a link to the Discord, and if you want to show me support, there's also, or, you know, send contributions whatever you want to call it i don't know what you guys want to call it but anyway there's some links to some of my merchandise in the uh, description down below also a tipping system okay so make sure you check them out and uh, yeah thank you for watching until next time have fun keep gaming and i'll see you in the next video bye bye guys